The, the gas in the middle of this is an argon gas. Mm -hmm. It might look like a refugee from a string of Christmas lights, but this tiny bulb from Luxem can put out as much light as a street light. Check it out. You've got a 400 watt bulb in this unit. In our system, we're running about 250 watts. Here's how it works. Electrical energy is delivered to a component called a puck. The puck acts like an electrical lens. The gases heat up, turn into a plasma, and give off light. A substantial portion of the energy gets turned into light rather than heat. How many of these will I need? And when you answer only one, yeah. they're like, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah, one for streetlight. <laughs> Luxem gets about 140 lumens per watt. High-end LEDs get around 70 lumens per watt, and an ordinary light bulb gets about 15. The key advantage is that the energy is driven into the bulb without any electrodes. So you don't use any electrical connections to mm. get the energy into the bulb. In the middle of the chamber, the plasma will be 6,000 Kelvin in temperature. Mm. So it will be the same temperature as the surface of the sun, which is why the spectrum looks very similar to the spectrum of the sun arriving on Earth. Lighting is hot these days, mostly because engineers and companies have ignored energy efficiency until recently. A lot of LED companies have received funds. Luxem, for instance, has received around 40 million in VC funds. We don't know who will win, but it seems clear that the bulbs and streetlights you grew up with are going to change soon.